Hi, it's James. Today we're gonna learn why it's cool to get a tiny carbon steel pen. Step number one, wash your potatoes. Always wash your potatoes. Peeling a potato is like cutting your toenails with a knife. You wanna use a sharp knife and you don't wanna cut too deep. Jesus Christ, Frank, are you cutting your toenails with a steak knife? Yeah, I suppose you have a problem with that too. Ah, go! Oh, botchto! Half a potato is what you'll need to make one potato pancake. I like slicing as thin as you possibly can. By the pangs of starvation. Still alive, still kicking. Sharing a pitiful crust between them. Share and share alike. Sharing and staring. And staring and sharing, and sharing. But are their spirits broken? Have they lost hope? You bet they have. Rotate and dice. Heat up your pan for about two minutes. Moments later. This is very important if you want to get a good initial crust. Smoking! Add enough oil to fill the bottom of the pan. Drop your shredded taters in. Now pat them down and form an even patty. We're gonna fry each side for six minutes. Season with salt to taste. Sometimes I add a bit more oil to prevent burning. A few minutes later. Put a dish down. And flippity flip. Now push down the sides. And this is single handedly why induction is better than gas. Now flippity flip again. And this is why you get a small frying pan, just to get that perfectly round potato roshti. Crack an egg, how to basic style. Whisk and fry. I like to fry it just on one side so you have a nice toasty bottom and it's a little runny on top. Looking good so far. I'm just gonna be lazy and use pancake mix from the supermarket but you can use whatever recipe you prefer. You'll want a fairly firm batter so just add a little bit of water to start with. Give it a stir and if it's too thick, just add a little bit more water because you want to get it quite gooey. If your batter is too diluted, then it tends to brown less well and kind of sticks to the pan a little. The residual oil from frying the eggs is the perfect amount because you don't want too much oil. Too much oil makes your pancake quite soggy. And the pan is nice and hot from frying the eggs before. So it's perfect for frying up pancakes right now. You can flip them after about one minute. Whoops, six out of 10. About 30 seconds later and it's all done. And there you have it, free easy peasy, perfectly round discs of breakfast awesomeness. Now garnish it with a bit of black pepper. Now prepare to lose your job from a maid cafe in Tokyo. Finally, a pat of butter. Now pour maple syrup as if it's the flood from Noah's Ark. Now please, subscribe to my channel, or else this doggy will not have the tuition fees to go to school.